Hi everyone, long time I see, I know, um, from the video that I made, was it the week before last, um, talking about the issues that I've had on YouTube and I wanted to come on here and give you a little bit of an update and the reason that I haven't done it sooner is because I've still been waiting on answers, I've still been trying to get things sorted and I didn't really want to come on here um, without kind of giving you <laughs> a proper final update really because I just thought that it would be a little bit pointless to just kind of keep saying I don't really know anything yet so I wanted to um, wait until I had all the information which funnily enough I still don't actually have but um, <laughs> I have still not really managed to get to the bottom of what the problem was I kind of have an inkling of what I think it might be but I've still not managed to get a straightforward pinpointed this is exactly what the issue was type of answer which was what I really wanted because I a wanted to kind of know you know what the what the problem was I wanted to know how I can avoid making that mistake if it was a mistake that I made in the future and you know it kind of just feels like you're being punished for something that you don't know um, it's like someone saying, well, you've committed a crime, so you're going to prison. What crime? A crime. Just a crime, and not being told what. And I know that's obviously like on a much grander scale, and that's very overdramatic, but I just really, really needed, for my own kind of peace of mind, to know. And I still don't really know. Um, and I've tried everything that I can think of um, to try and get answers. I've spoken to the YouTube help desk, which isn't very helpful and who kind of don't have answers and then they've had to contact other departments and a lot of kind of the communication that you have it seems to me like it's just sort of standard responses that they give to everybody um, and they just kind of churn them out and it's not necessarily relevant to the question that you've asked and I have been so specific in what I've wanted to know and they just kind of can't really tell you it's it's just really strange and I'd also got my previous management company so I'd been with Style Hall for quite a while and then I wanted to be um, on my own for a while but they were kind enough to still look into it for me and it was just all very very confusing there were people that were saying that um, <clears throat> losing your monetization shouldn't have happened just because of the strike I like YouTube said that in one email and then two emails down the line they were like oh yes it's because your channel's in bed standing and I generally get how it works in that you get a strike which can make your channel become in bed standing which then means you can't monetize but it doesn't seem to be that way for everybody some people are still able to monetize it's very very complicated and it has really really opened my eyes to the kind of lack of organisation um, within this platform and the fact that there really is no one you can turn to unless you are one of the kind of content creators that's making the big bucks and that really matter. Um, there isn't really much that you can do to get answers and to kind of get support and I also kind of think, well obviously you know, I am going to think this because it's me as happening to, but I just think that it's kind of a very harsh shut down penalty for someone who has never had a single problem on their channel. I just think it's just really weird um, and that it's one of those things where you know it's just really methodical and they just do it um, and it's the same rule for everyone kind of thing, not looking into individual cases and I really wish that they would give you a chance to resolve it because had I been given a chance to resolve it I would have just deleted the video straight away, it wasn't even anything important, I wasn't bothered my channel ma matters more to me than just a single video so I, <coughs> sorry, I've had like a cough for about three years um, that won't go away so yeah, that's kind of it. I just keep looking at what time we're at because I can't be longer than 15 minutes. Um, not that I kind of would be, but you know, it just makes you feel paranoid. Um, and I also wanted to thank you all so much for the comments on my previous video. Um, they were just 
so so lovely and what was so lovely especially was reading comments from people who don't usually comment and I found that so interesting because I'm not someone who comments on videos I watch copious amounts of YouTube videos daily but it's always while I'm doing something so while I'm making dinner while I'm in the bath while I'm doing my skincare and I I'll watch a YouTube video I'm constantly watching videos while I'm doing things so because I'm kind of busy I don't necessarily um, I don't necessarily then kind of have time to type. I'm busy doing other things and it's just kind of in the background. So I really, really appreciate those of you who took the time to, to type a comment when you don't normally. And all of your suggestions were taken on board and I have literally done everything that I can but the response I have gotten from both YouTube and from Style Hall looking into it has been that there is nothing they can do and I'm just going to have to wait out for six months which isn't so much of a problem um you know obviously the kind of financial side of it does suck I'm not gonna lie that is pretty annoying um but it's it's okay I can kind of I can manage um but it's just the whole experience really that's just left a really really bad taste in my mouth and it's not that it's made me not want to make youtube videos but it's just really made me question the kind of platform um and kind of how it treats its content creators and the fact that there's no one you can speak to it's just really kind of made me question things a little bit and where my channel is going to go from here um, and the answer to that is my channel's still going to stay the same because I've put so much work into it and I love doing it that it is going to have to still um, push forward and six months is a really long time but you know by just before Christmas I mean it's just it's such a long time things will kind of be back to normal and like I've said before it's not necessarily <coughs> It's not about the money because it's not, you know, even that much money. Um, it's just the kind of whole situation that's just been quite depressing. Um, it's I, I can't pinpoint exactly what it is and I can't pinpoint what it's kind of why I feel this way. But it's been a combination of a lot of things. Um, these these past couple of years, if I'm being honest, have just been really tough, and I just keep feeling like you know, things in different areas of life just keep going wrong, and things keep happening. And every time I think I've kind of got to grips and I'm kind of okay with stuff and things are getting better, then something else happens. And I know that that's life. I know that, but it just sometimes feels to me like, um like we have more than our fair share of things that just randomly go wrong I mean I know it could be worse and touch wood everything you know but um yeah I don't know I've, I've, I've had a rough couple of weeks it's just been you know we were recovering from kind of what happened a few um, months ago of recovering you're not recovering from it but kind of dealing with that and then just this kind of happening it's just been another like really you don't always kind of have the strength to just sort of keep fighting and I've had to because I've wanted to get answers and I've kind of done everything I can do and I still haven't managed to get much out of it so I kind of do feel like I've kind of failed at even getting an answer and I know it's not my fault, I know that um, but it, it still just kind of feels that way um, and going forward this channel is just going to stay the same you know you're still going to see videos from me it probably will be even funner for you because there won't be adverts at the beginning of the video which most people find quite annoying um so yeah they there won't be adverts in the beginning of the videos and i will still try and keep to my kind of two or three videos a week and i'm also gonna try and dedicate more time to my other channel so those of you who kind of don't know i haven't made like a big song and dance about it because i understand that it's probably not something that would appeal to everybody but i do have a second channel called um a fear beauty that is or is it a fears beauty i think i'll link it down below um that's a relatively new channel there's only like two videos on it that is a channel that I have started up in Hebrew because I wanted to be able to do that as well and to kind of um, reach that kind of audience too and um, I haven't kind of 
given it as much attention as it deserves purely because I've been working on this channel and I've also just had so much other stuff going on but I think that this has kind of made me think about that I need to kind of give both um, both channels more attention and I want to kind of start doing stuff on my blog more because let's face it I have a blog that just doesn't really get much attention at all um, and just kind of focusing on that a little bit more and being a little bit more productive and you know it's not just with that there's tons of other areas within life and that kind of thing that I think I need to just sort of tackle and change and things like that you know being fat <laughs> is another one of them um, which affects my happiness so so tremendously probably more than it should but that's just how I am um, and I, yeah, I just wanted to come on here and kind of let you know that from next week kind of normal service will resume. I've got a couple of kind of pre-recorded videos that I think I'm going to put up. I can't even remember um, what they were now because it was from literally before the whole thing happened. But I've got two of them and they're edited and ready to go so that will be going up. And I've got an empties coming up and some other videos. So if you've got any other video requests and things that you'd like me to talk about then by all means put those in the comments down below and I will um, and <coughs> literally this cough has just been driving me mental um, and that's about it really um, I again thank you all so so much for all your support and all of your um, kind of affection and everything like that I know someone did question on that kind of how long it why does it take so long to make videos when there's not tons of fancy editing and all that kind of thing and it's just one of those things you know just to transfer the video from your camera to your computer takes a good 15 minutes to save it after you've edited it takes a good 15 minutes it is quite a sort of time consuming thing um but it's one that you know is so worth it because all of the lovely comments that you left just proves to me this is why i'm doing this because it matters to some people um, and because it matters to me and it's fun for me and I feel like you know it's just it's part of who I am now almost um, so yeah I will love you and leave you now because we're already at 12 minutes um, but I hope you enjoyed this video and like I said normal service will resume next week back to normal beauty videos if you've got any requests for any other types of videos or anything like that then please let me know um, I have been thinking about maybe doing some other kind of non beauty type of things on here as well um, if you've got any requests or ideas for that then let me know like maybe sort of I don't know I was going to say advice, but like, don't take advice from me. I know nothing. I'm like Jon Snow. Um, but yeah, I love you all so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.